Hey, this is Travis with Diesel Laptops. Today we're hooked to a John Deere 7820 farm tractor with the Tex Off Highway Module. And as you see here, we scroll down and we'll pick the John Deere. And this will be the 7020 series. All right, and John Deere again. I'm going to have to click that tractor. And this will show you all the different modules you have on this particular tractor. But the first one we're going to go to is Vehicle Checkup OEM. And we'll choose the adapter here. We're just on a standard 9-pin connection off of the dash on this machine and the ignition is on okay give this just a second to connect it connects fairly quickly and here we go okay as you can see no faults your status is going to show you what you have errors in what you don't and then it'll take just a second to populate here but there we go all right, and then on your activation, it's just going to be your error clearing there. But we'll back out here, and we're going to go into the engine ECU next. And same deal with it. It's pretty quick to connect here. All right, and start. And nine pin adapter. Okay, and there we go. Ignition is on. Same deal with this one no faults in it but your different parameters here you're going to have a total of 48 different parameters pretty good coverage here you got intake manifold pressures rail pressures engine speeds coolant temperatures battery voltages and you can actually double click those and it'll graph it out for you if you need to in that case but total of 48 here so We'll scroll over here to the ECU info next, which will just have your VINs, your serial numbers, some part numbers for your ECU. But your activations, you'll have your compression tests and cylinder cutouts. But we'll exit out of this and we'll move over to the next module here. And scroll down here to the rear lift and self diagnosis and 9 pin. All right, we'll give it just a second to load. Confirm. And we're connected. No faults again, but your parameters here, we'll kind of scroll through those. We've got 36 different ones on here for your lifting speeds, oil temperatures, some different voltages and things here. And next we'll slide over here to the status, which will, you know, what's active, what's not active. And some of your ECU info there. And of course, in your settings, you've got the lifter calibration, which is important. But let's disconnect here, and we'll go into one more module here. All right, and we're going to go into the transmission here, and this will be the top one. Nine pin again. Okay, ignition's on. And just a second here to connect. As you can see, same deal as before. You've got 16 different parameters. You've got a good many here. Get your park and brake pressures and clutch pressures, things of that nature. Overall, on the transmission side, pretty good coverage as well. All right. Thanks for watching.